over here is I followed those 230 kV power lines in the opposite direction and I figured I would check out this decommissioned power plant. So 230 kV and those are I believe uh, 69 kV monopoles next to it. This is where those 69 kV monopoles dead end. As you can see there's a riser right there. Right about ground level, pretty interesting. So that's about five foot tall. You got the surge resters on the left side and the bushings from the cables are on the right side. We come up and then go down towards that direction. Well, here's a pretty good vantage point of the substation. There are four 230 kV power lines that feed this sub. Um, you can see two of them right there. It almost looks like a, a image error, but there's two monopoles right there, and then there's one each style pole there. 230 kV, and then there's a 138 kV line there, the lattice style. We come into this pretty big substation. You can see the bus bar there, and seems to terminate at a pretty large 230 kV three phase transformer. And then right behind the tree line, looks like there's a uh, 138 kV to 34, 500 substation transformer. There's another substation transformer right there. And that there looks like a 230 kV capacitor bank. Pretty interesting. It looks like there's three uh, individual capacitors in uh, series. Now those lattice style structures uh, feed those 138 kV uh, power lines that were in the last video. And next to them is a uh, relatively modern built. Uh, 69 kV circuit. I believe those were built maybe, I'm, I believe they were built in 2005. It was probably pretty high tech back in the day with those polymer insulators. And those H style or the lattice structures. Uh, the 138 kV circuit terminates there. One circuit there and then the other circuit goes to a power pole and that's 34 500 volts and that looks like the coal storage silos this is a coal power plant uh, the power plant actually used to uh, span from right about there to where those uh, maintenance or buildings or machine rooms are on the smokestack were uh, interesting they tore down the power plant but kept the silos and the smokestacks not too sure why. And then those 230 kV monopoles, which I began following, it looks like they terminate right there. Here's a better vantage point to show the scale uh, between the silos and the smokestacks. You can see there looks to be an actual uh, rail car rotator in that steel building, which is right next to the silos. And along here are old uh, railroad tracks.